Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And uh, Google Chrome has added a new, well, not a new feature. The feature already existed inside the browser, which is a memory saver feature. But with uh, the latest versions, they've added one more option to that uh, feature. Um, what it is is that you had uh, two settings before for the memory uh, saving feature. So if you go to your uh, Google Chrome browser, you go in the upper right in the three vertical dots, go to more tools in the list. And here you'll go to performance. And the performance, you will have memory saver here. So the memory saver had balanced and moderate. Now they have balanced, moderate, and maximum. So you could uh, optimize the amount of RAM used. Technically, changing this should show up uh, and you should see a difference in the task manager when you actually go and look at the amount of memory that the, the um, Chrome browser is using. So uh, this should technically show a, a better management of memory. So uh, we'll see if it does, but um, there's really moderate balance and maximum now. So uh, if you want to try that, if you find that uh, Chrome is using too much RAM when you're using it, um, if you use maximum, what happens is the maximum memory savings, the tabs that are open on your browser will become inactive after shorter periods of times. So it's really a question of managing, uh, especially managing the tabs uh, that you have uh, open. So um, check it out and uh, maybe you'll have some memory saving in there. Um, the price of that could be a little bit of problem in the um, in the uh, performance because if you get inactive tabs, it might actually impact the tabs um, performance themselves. But um, you know, to save RAM for some of you, it could be a good idea. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.